This video will talk about how to configure OSD with Orovision V500 series encoders. We support text, image, logo, system time, overlay. Now let's check how it work. Open the web browser and log in the web page of the encoder. Click OSD and you can see here text setting, picture setting. Insert two groups of text and two pictures at the same time for each group. Open text 1. Choose enable. You can see some of the setup parameters. Text 2 is the same as text 1. Insert text and set text coordinates, size, color etc. Press the Setup button and reboot the encoder after any change the parameter. After reboot the encoder, you can use the HTTP address to pay it OBS player to see. Copy the HTTP address of the encoder. Open OBS and create a new media source. Without selecting Local File. Paste the HTTP address into Input and click OK. You can see the added text has been added to the screen. Change the relevant parameters of text and look again. You will see the corresponding changes in the OBS. When you want to upload a picture, logo, open, picture settings, enable. Here you will see some parameters for image upload. Note that images are only supported in BMP format and the file size is less than 1M. Explanation. 1. The set of the three pictures that can be inserted are the same. 2. Transparent background of the picture setting. R177, G204, B233. Set up the image as required and save it in BMP format. Upload an image in BMP format and set the parameters. Press the Setup button and reboot the encoder after any change the parameter. After reboot the encoder, you can use the HTTP address to pay it OBS player to see. Copy the HTTP address of the encoder. Open OBS and create a new media source. Without selecting Local File. Paste the HTTP address into Input and click OK. You can see the added picture, logo, has been added to the screen. Change the relevant parameters of image and look again. You will see the corresponding changes in the OBS. Add images and text at the same time. In the OBS, you can see that pictures and text have been added to the screen. If you need to enable the NTP function, the encoder must be linked to the WAN, or have an NTP server on the LAN. Click on System, and you can see the NTP option. Open NTP service and select your zone SLE. Note, while opening NTP service, you need to open the text overlay and insert the text time. After the parameters are set, reboot the encoder. Copy the HTTP address of the encoder. Open OBS and create a new media source. Without selecting local file, paste the HTTP address into input and click OK. 
The NTP time is displayed on the screen. Now we have finished the text, picture, system time overlay. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions about it, please contact us.